What is up guys, this is Talit and today I'm going to be showing you JTAG RPC which allows you to do remote procedure calls on JTAGs as well as dev kits, it works on both. Um, it has the same functionality as XDRPC although I need to add in a few features such as uh, returning values and also byte array uh, sending and marshalling. Uh, so the first thing you're going to want to do is install my DLL and default MPXEX. Currently this only works for MW2. I'm not going to put in a sys DLL yet. Um, I probably will soon, but right now I just want to keep it confined to MW2. So as you can see, we're just on the regular dashboard there. And we're going to click on M default MP. And it should say, there we go. I don't know if you can see that, JTAG RPC by delete. If you see that message, it means you're ready to connect. So we can just open up JTAG RPC here. And as you can see here, we have a little nice uh, UI that I've designed. You're going to want to click connect. Okay, let's let this autofocus. Mm, nothing. Okay, so it says connection successful. And there we go. So now uh, we just have to add in some addresses. So the first thing we're going to do is add in the function address. So I'm going to use a client command function address, which I'm just going to paste in there. So you're going to want to paste the function address of the function you want to call in here. And then we're going to go to add, and we're going to add a variable, or rather a parameter. Um, so this is client command, so the first parameter is a long. Well, it's an int, but for now let's call it a long, since I only have that data type defined so far and we're going to put in 0 because our client number is 0 and next we're going to put in a string and this is going to be our actual command so we can put in here set time scale 2 click call and now we have chipmunk I don't know if you guys can hear the music but it's considerably faster and yeah, so now I'm just going to go to system link and we can do some server commands maybe. Forgive weapon. I don't know, I'm not sure. Time unlimited, score unlimited. Alright, so let's start up the game. And in the meantime, we're going to switch over and we're going to select delete and delete the arguments. And now we're going to copy over our send server command function address and paste it back in this box here. Alrighty. So now we're going to go to add a variable. We're going to add three variables. First one is going to be a long. That's going to be our client index. Second one we're going to be it's going to be a long. That's going to be the command type, which is one. Third one is going to be a string. Alright. So let's go over here. Uh, this is going to be 1. We're in system link, so the client number is 0. And let's go over here. String. Uh, C. Sorry, I'm doing this with one hand. Camera might be a little bit shaky as well. Alright, so we're going to make it say hello RPC in a server command. Alright, so now let's click call. Oh, wait, first it's set. As you can see, it is chipmunk, like I said before. Okay, so now let's just click call there. Call it a few times. And as you can see, it says... Oh, I'm going to put it in slow-mo. Or you know what? Here. Let me untether my camera. Alright. Where's our mouse here? There we go. Okay. As you can see, I'll click it again. Click it, click it. Very short delay uh, between the time that the procedure call is executed. Uh, now we can do a different one. Let's do uh, hello RPC, some random, random characters. Okay. As you can see, the random characters are showing up. Uh, we can also do things like uh, set field of view. So we'll do scg underscore FOV space 120. Alrighty. Let's check out how it looks. One, two, three. Well, first I'll click it. 
Right. Ta-da! Field of View mods. Uh, now we can go back and let's do, uh, what else could we do? Uh, we could do time, I believe we can do time scale through this. 0 0.5. Yeah, there we go. Now that should be slow-mo. And there you have it, uh, JTAG RPC, coming to a theater near you. No, just fucking with you, but it will be released soon. Alright guys, I'm out.